Victoria Falls is situated on the border of Zimbabwe and Zambia, somewhere in the middle of Zambezi River flow. It is one of the biggest rivers in Africa. On the right bank of Victoria, the height of the waterfall is 80 meters. In the center, it is 108 meters. That is why it is the only waterfall in the world that is more than 100 meters high and over one kilometer wide at the same time. The noise from the waterfall is heard 40 kilometers away. Its splashes and fog rise 40 meters above as a cloud that looks like smoke from afar. In 1989, the waterfall was designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. All other tribes that settled in these places bowed to the power and greatness of the waterfall. In the language of several African ethnic groups, it is called the Smoke that Thunders. The present name of the waterfall was given by a Scottish doctor and missionary David Livingstone. He is believed to be the first to have discovered it in 1855. They say that this true citizen of Britain was overwhelmed by its beauty and said, This is the dust from the wings of angels. God save the Queen. Thus the waterfall was named after the Queen of Britain of those days, Victoria. After the waterfall, the river flows through narrow sharp rifts with many turns and falls into a big lake called Boiling Port. Many vortexes make it look like boiling. Below the Boiling Port, there is a 200-meter-long bridge in the form of an arc. It was built in the beginning of 20th century and still remains the only railway between Zambia and Zimbabwe. The territory around the waterfall has been inhabited 3 million years ago by the representatives of the Homo genus Homo habilis australopithecus, handy man. There is a natural mountain basin with still water in the top point of Victoria. From September to December, when the water level is low, you can swim here. It is very scary to stand on the edge of the abyss, but the name Devil's Pool was given to it for another reason. According to the legends, in ancient times, human sacrifices took place here. In rainy season, the flow in the waterfall amounts to 9,100 cubic meters per second. During the droughts, it shortens to a couple of small streams. Small drops of water that fly in the air burn sun rays and create rainbows. At the same time, Victoria is famous for its unusual rainbows. When the moon is full, the sun rays, reflected from the moon, fall on these drops of water. <laughs> 